The disturbing video was posted on the internet today by WikiLeaks, a whistleblower website. And it shows graphic gun camera images of a U.S. helicopter attack in Baghdad in July 2007. That's a weapon, yeah. The aerial assault plays out over 40 minutes with an Apache helicopter pilot, call sign Crazy Horse 18, repeatedly requesting permission to fire on a group of men he believes to be insurgents. Hotel 26, Crazy Horse 18, have individuals with weapons. Four radio. You're clear. All right, firing. The Apache and a second gunship open up with machine guns as the men on the ground try to flee. A short time later, they ask again for permission to fire. Come on, let us shoot. More than a dozen people were killed. It's believed that two Iraqis working for the Reuters news service were among the dead. For two years, the Pentagon has refused to release the video or the findings of its internal investigation. But WikiLeaks says it obtained the video from whistleblowers and then published it to prove that the helicopters were not under fire or acting in self-defense. Now, it appears from the tape that at least some of those hit on the ground were unarmed. But a journalist who was in the general area that same day says it's important for all of us to remember it was a hectic, violent, and uneasy day. Harry? Bob Orr again in Washington tonight. Thanks.